Hello everyone, and thank you for joining. Today's webinar is going to be a presentation on Jamf Protect and how it's solving the unique challenges of macOS endpoint security. My name is Jib Chan. I'm a pre-sales engineer at Jamf, working out of the Sydney office. We're part of a team that is focusing on helping organizations navigate Apple's management and security tools available, as well as on how we can make the Apple management and user experience better with Jamf. The agenda for today, we're going to cover the simplest path to macOS security by understanding how are Apple helping you to remain protected from known threats? How does Jamf Protect work? A look at some scenarios as to what Jamf Protect can help secure and report. And security incident response with Jamf. How to use Jamf Protect as well as other products in the Jamf portfolio to respond to Mac-based threats in the events that are detected. But first, a quick reminder of who we are at Jamf. And if there's people on this webinar who haven't come across us before, our goal as a company is to help organizations succeed with Apple, and indeed have been doing so since 2002. To do that, Jamf offers a portfolio of enterprise-grade solutions that are ready to help you tackle authentication and device management. With multiple options, you can find a solution that will work best for you and your organization. Jamf Connect for authentication and identity management. Jamf Now for device management with no IT required. Jamf School for Education and Jamf Pro, the leader in Apple device management. Jamf Protect, our newest product offering endpoint protection to help with challenges that are unique to the Apple ecosystem. Underpinning all of this is Jamf Nation which is still the world's largest community of Apple administrators, with more than 100,000 users ready to help you learn more about our products and offer support in your time of technical need. So we're all aware of Apple's growth within organizations, including the enterprise, as employees are choosing Macs more. And as these choices are being made, more of the device counts are going to rise resulting in security teams asking how can we mitigate risk and gain more visibility into the Mac OS that is comparable to the rest of our end-user computer state. Endpoint security solutions are nothing new and indeed have a long history in the tech stack of any organizations protecting themselves. However, this is predominantly comes on Windows. The internals of PC have been well understood and relatively unchanged. Plus, critically, security teams know the tools available to them and how to analyze those results when it comes to looking at both known malware as well as behavioral traits of would-be attackers. It's apparent that just as Apple devices are treated differently than PCs when it comes to OS management, they also need to be treated to PCs with regards to endpoint security. Malicious attackers are starting to focus on building tools that take advantage of the infrastructure on macOS in order to infiltrate organizations, and security teams need to be equipped with the best tools to help them defend their endpoints, regardless of the platform. Now enter Jamf Protect. Jamf Protect is Mac-focused endpoint security solution that's going to help your organization protect Apple endpoints. With Jamf Protect, we're going to help with some of the more unique challenges when it comes to macOS security. First, we are preventing macOS malware and watch for any behavioral threats specific to the Mac. While most malware has focused on Windows platform, the growth of Macs in the enterprise have also resulted in more Mac targeted malware. Jamf Protect is there to ensure that known Mac malware is prevented from launching and quarantine on your devices without further interactions by you. Beyond that, every organization needs granular understanding of what's happening on their Macs. Jamf Protect gives you insight into these unique events and behaviors and alerts your security team to take action against Mac-based threats, which would otherwise go unnoticed. Jamf Protect has granular understanding of macOS behaviors, including those unique to Apple's architecture. Our macOS security research feeds our analysis of these activities to provide a deeper context compared to Windows first products. Next, we're going to give your organization the power of compliance while still making sure we're preserving the end user experience that draws them to Apple's in the first place. Organizations have been charged to meet and maintain configurations and audit records of their devices for compliance. With Jamf, you have the comprehensive abilities to collect endpoint logs, 
audit security standards and monitor for any drift from those guidelines without disruptions, plus minimal impact to the performance of the user's Mac. Keeping your employees productive, collaborative, and as engaged as Apple users expect, while they gain insights necessary for your IT and security teams. When new Mac OS versions release, your security tools should never be the reason you delay your Mac OS upgrade plans, and Jam Protect takes this very seriously. Lastly, incorporating custom methods of remediation to threats and security events. Jamf Protect provides you with a variety of tools to prevent the execution of malware or known unwanted applications and design the interactions with end users. So let's jump in, take a look at a couple of different scenarios and actual risks that your end users may face, followed by how Jamf Protect can help security teams protect and monitor the organization's Mac fleet. In this scenario, we're going to cover monitoring for visibility and compliance by extending the native security tools that actually ship with the operating system. Mac comes preloaded with built-in security features like XProtect, Gatekeeper, and the malware removal tools. These baseline protections are great and Apple does a good job, but there are some areas that can be further enhanced to support organizations. First of these is visibility. Knowing your device is protected is one thing, but InfoSec teams need to know when these events occur for reporting on the status of the environment, plus they can determine if there's any additional impact. Now here in this example, we have received or obtained an application. We go to open it and unbeknownst to the end user, this particular application has been compromised with malware. And as we can see here, Gatekeeper has been triggered informing the end user that this application shouldn't be on their device and they need to remove it. Now as an organization, you can respond to your end users by letting them know you've got their back. You understand what's taken place and you can do so at any time one of these native security events have occurred. You can do something to this notification and have any sort of custom prompt. So when it comes to visibility, now you can be aware when these native security are triggered and take it a step further by customizing it for your organization. All of this data is sent back to Jamf Protect. This is an example of Jamf Protect Alert Field. So anytime one of those native security has an event, that data is then pushed into the Jamf Protect UI. And from here, you can see we're pulling in as much data as possible about the event, meaning you can do some accurate analysis of those possible threats. What's great is Jamf Protect understands that security teams rely on more than just one tool. So all of this data can be sent back to your seam. More on that later. Now, the activity detection isn't the only visibility we're giving you into the native security tools. Jamf Protect takes the visibility to a step further with the embedded Apple security dashboard, where we have a collection of all the events from XProtect, Gatekeeper, and malware removal tool. We have even added in compliance monitoring. So you can validate your users are up to date on the latest version and have the latest features enabled. To continue on the topic of compliance, Jamf Protect is also auditing on a large number of settings on the device that is currently mapped to the CIS benchmark. This is under our Insights reporting page, helping you to monitor and assess your organization's security baseline to determine compliance across your entire Mac fleet. Each insight collected is optional, allowing you to craft a tailored report specific to you and your security posture. Another great source of visibility on the Mac is through unified logging. We know to do a proper analysis of a potential threat or malicious event, you need as much data as possible. The more contextual data you have, the more informed you are. Without that, it's like looking at a jigsaw puzzle with half the pieces missing. Tapping into unified logs, where you can now pinpoint device, file, process, and user data, which was otherwise siloed on each individual Mac. This, plus the event data collected by Jamf Protect from its curated events monitoring, will give you a complete picture of the activities on your Mac. And to analyze data, we know most enterprise organizations rely on a seam. Jamf Protect can integrate into your seam. This is an example of Jamf Protect data in a Splunk dashboard. The data is in JSON and comes through over port 443 from the Mac. 
The data is easily searchable and re readable in most seams. Now, to go back to unified logging, you can see here we have a visual activity of the endpoint. This data came from Jamf Protect filtering from unified logging and generating a JSON file. With these filters, you can easily collect activity like the login attempts, password changes, or airdrop transactions. Some of this may not necessarily be suspicious activity, but when visualized within a seam and combined with all your other security data, you're seeing a better picture of your fleet. For our second scenario, Apple largely focus on really impactful threats, and they tend to steer clear of things that end users decide to install, even if they are tricked. Jamf Protect delivers threat protection database curated by a Jamf security research team. This will prevent the execution of known malware that isn't currently covered by Apple's own signature database. You'll see in this video that the user is attempting to open a file that has recently been downloaded. As soon as the user attempts to run the process, that is a known threat, immediately upon execution, there is a signature match and Jamf Protect will block and remove that threat immediately. And what's also important is all of these results are reported back to our UI. We have highlighted all of the threat prevention activity. And just like we saw earlier with gatekeeper detection, we're collecting a robust level of information. Diving deeper into that particular alert that has been collected by Jamf Protect, we've gathered a ton of additional information, including all of the processes involved in the execution, the binary information for those processes, including the path of where it was called from, as well as the hash and the signing information. In Jamf Protect, you'll be kept up to date on any version changes to our threat prevention database as well as the option of creating your own custom prevent list, allowing you to block processes that is unique to your organization, essentially creating your own block list from the binary level. For our last use case, let's take a look at some behavioral based detection and another example of remediation. In this case, the user has been tricked into installing a fake flash installer. And this is a really common delivery mechanism for macOS malware. Downloading this installer triggers a Jamf Protect heuristic detection, which for illustration purposes, we have decided to remediate by pushing a policy from Jamf Pro, making the end user aware of what actions were taken to isolate their computer by cutting it off from the network. This also helps limit the impact of possible breaches and keeping the computer quarantined until it can be further analyzed. Heading back into the Jamf Protect console, we'll see all of the information on this event is reported. To even include the actual URL that malicious file was downloaded from. This is one example of behavioral event analytic. We have an extensive number of heuristic analytics as well as analytics mapped on the MITRE ATT&CK framework. When the security team identifies a threat on an endpoint, we already know IT has to get involved in helping to manage the isolation and remediation of the computer. Jamf Protect and Jamf Pro make great combinations for this. Jamf Protect identifies an issue with a Mac, and in turn it will place that Mac into a special smart group. The smart group can be placed into an exclusion scope for things to access like corporate email, so that the threat doesn't continue to expand to other end users or removing the appropriate certificates that grant access to Wi-Fi or VPN until they contact the help desk for remediation. When recovery can be managed through the self-service by the end user, Jamf Pro can easily provide instructions to guide the end user back to a safe state. After an attack has been stopped, cleaning up the computer is always a complicated process, since usually the device is not physically present for IT. With Jamf Pro, any remaining artifacts from the attack can easily be managed remotely. For an extreme case, IT can even reinstall the Mac OS on a device and redeploy any existing applications to ensure that the computer is once again safe and fully trusted. So today we've taken a quick look into Jamf Protect. We have seen how 
Jamf Protect can extend native macOS security features that come built in by providing additional visibility and actions. We have seen several scenarios of Jamf Protect alerts in real time and notify your end users of any action that is taking place on their device, as well as built in malware prevention functionality to stop any malicious software in its tracks. The ability of behavioral analysis. Using Jamf security team's expertise to hunt for malicious behaviors using our analytics engine, feeding Apple's built-in gameplay kit, and finally, deployment flexibility. Sending telemetry data and alerts either to Jamf Protect Cloud or to your organization's scene. To summarize, Jamf Protect will give organizations the monitoring and visibility of all the activity that is important for InfoSec teams on their Mac. Custom response and remediation, integration into their seams and auditing of your devices, all while still mapping to the industry standard with our behavioral detections, processing all of the analysis on the device so we don't need to send the data to a secondary source to keep our reporting as near as real time as possible. We're also going to minimize the device resources to preserve experience that draws your end users to Apple. And like always at Jamf, we will support the latest release of macOS from the day Apple makes it available. So let's finish up by looking at Apple and the security model for macOS from the bottom up. macOS contains baseline security capabilities like file vault encryption. It provides native security tooling built on top of trust, signing, notarization, and malware scanning. It provides local logging and visibility via its unified log. Jamf Pro layers on here first. With capabilities to manage local encryption of FileVault, key escrow, and can harden endpoints with best practice via configuration profiles and policies. From here, Jamf Protect provides an additional layer of security. Out of the box, Jamf Protect will add compliance auditing against a set of industry standard back benchmarks. It brings visibility to the native security tooling by reporting not only on configurations, but also on any detection and actions taken by the OS. And as shown earlier, our macOS centric threat prevention blocks and quarantines even more threats. The most advanced feature within Jamf Protect is our ability to detect unknowns or brand new variants of threats by dynamically analyzing activities and behaviors. For the final insight into macOS, we provide capabilities to centralize unified log activities, allowing you to filter through this rich data set across your entire fleet, streaming only what's important to you to a central repository for inspection and analysis. All of this coupled with Jamf Pro to remediate threats and further improve your security posture. And with, finally, with Jamf Connect, we can then ensure that all of our users maintain good identity security and manage their sign-on experience. And to finish off, helping organizations succeed with Apple as we continue to provide Apple-focused solutions, putting the Apple experience first. Thank you for your time today. We hope you are taking away a better understanding of Jamf Protect and the Jamf portfolio. Please scan the QR code, head to jamf.com, or contact us directly for more information.